Euro dollar daily forecast, January 25th, FXEmpire.com. The euro dollar pairs you can see shot up on the uh, trading session on Thursday, but we still remain within this little consolidation area that we see as being bordered by uh, 134 and uh, 13250 or so on the bottom. So, having said that, uh, it's not necessarily a breakout. It was a nice, strong day, and if you're a short-term trader, you probably made money. The real deal is going to be uh, whether or not we can get above the 135 level, and I will actually have to zoom out to the weekly chart to show and explain this. Here, right about here, the 135 level, uh, we would see what would be known as a neckline. This neckline would signify that a head and shoulders inverted head and shoulders I should say has broken and the interesting thing about this is it suggests because it's 15 handles high at that point in time we would be heading back up to right around the 150 level don't think it can happen it certainly can that used to be the norm in this pair it used to just chug along in one direction and that was up if you've traded Forex more than four years you know what I mean but many of you probably haven't it used to be that you could simply buy this pair every time it pulled back and you made money essentially same thing in the dollar yen pair which is about what which is very similar to what we're seeing here so it looks like we may be going back to the old norms of forex which uh, by the standards of the last couple of years will be an absolute piece of cake for many of you if that's the case you're going to be very happy everybody loves the euro and in fact Back then, there were a lot of traders who focused only on the euro, and they would just simply keep buying it as it went up. So it'll be interesting to see what happens, but 135 is crucial. 134 begins a serious resistance area up here. We are right there. It's difficult to sell at this point because it's been so strong, but certainly we need to see uh, another move higher to consider putting new money to work because we are really flirting with uh, what could only be described as a major pivot point in this uh, chart. And as a matter of fact, it's so major, it even shows up quite cleanly on the monthly chart.